We'll begin TVC News at 10 from Germany, where the Federal Republic of Nigeria and the Federal Republic of Germany witnessed further expansion and strengthening as two important agreements were signed between Nigerian and German businesses on Tuesday in Berlin. President Bola Tinubu told investors at the 10th German Nigerian Business Forum that Nigeria has a resilient democracy and is already positioned to attract foreign direct investments. TVC News State House correspondent Femi Akonde reports. Beyond the Compact with Africa Forum, President Bola Tinubu is still courting investors and marketing existing business opportunities in Nigeria. He is here at the German Nigeria Business Forum that seeks to create partnerships for transformative change. Okay. This is the first time a Nigerian president will attend this business forum. I'm looking forward to having you in Nigeria, investing more. President Tenobu's strong message to prospective investors is a commitment to eliminate all obstacles in the path of investors. Economic matter is a challenge. The risk factor in investment is always going to be there. Who could have expected what is happening in Ukraine? Fast investment opportunity. But you have the alternative. Agriculture is one of the most flourishing opportunities. Education. We have vibrant youth population, very vibrant, trainable, dynamic. So we can exchange for one another to flourish. Nigeria is also home to a multitude of investment opportunities in several sectors, including pharmaceuticals, medical technologies, automotive development, infrastructure, the green economy, technology, mining and energy. Nigeria is also at the beginning of automotive development with growing interest in our fintech and agrotech spaces. This is an area I envisage a lot of scope for collaboration with German firms. Nigeria is currently Germany's second largest trading partner in sub-Saharan Africa. But Germany, as Europe's economic bloc, seeks to bring more investments into Nigeria that will be mutually beneficial to both countries. We are delighted to see that this partnership, especially with regard to trade relations, has witnessed significant growth during the last year. We're seeing many encouraging examples of successful business cooperation also demonstrated by the fact that some 90 German companies are already present uh, in Nigeria. Together, they have created more than 17,000 jobs and provide, provided many opportunities for technical and vocational training. So the <laughs> private sector in Nigeria seems to be excited about the approach of President Bola Tinubu towards promoting investment opportunities in Nigeria. And they agree as well that Nigeria is ready to do business. When you look at the key reforms we've had, the exchange rate, which was a real bottleneck to people investing, the merger of the exchange rates, the, the fuel subsidy where we lost a billion dollars a month, these things were pulled through within days of him starting his administration. So um, execution of our existing investment framework is the challenge. And I think with the new minister we have and her team, we're seeing a one-stop office for approvals for, for businesses, foreign investors to come in. The most important thing is that there is political will to resolve a lot of those bottlenecks that the investors and others faced in the past. Uh, there, is a, there are a lot of steps being taken to increase the amount of liquidity because at the, at the end of the day, it's about liquidity. Right? And steps are being taken to increase the level of FX liquidity in the system. And by having excess liquidity in the system, it makes it easier for the airlines and anyone else who wants to repatriate the proceeds of their business to repatriate those. President Bola Tinubu's ambitious economic reforms has put Nigeria under the radar of developed economies and global financial institutions. 
The German Nigeria Business Forum is one platform that would lead investors to meet opportunities. This kind of business meetings will certainly not be the last. Going by President Bola Tinobu's desire to attract foreign direct investments into the country. But as soon as the results begin to yield, Nigerians may also start to appreciate the efforts made so far. Femi Akonde, TVC News, Berlin, Germany. State House correspondent Femi Akonde joins me now from Berlin in Germany. Femi, Nigeria is ready for business and Niger State is already positioning itself. What is the latest from Nigeria's investment drive in Germany? growing uh, or, or create an environment for businesses uh, to thrive. And this time, the focus is on uh, German businesses because Germany is the biggest economy in Europe. And Nigeria is interested in leveraging on its existing relationship with Germany to attract more German businesses into Nigeria. As it stands now, there are more than 90 uh, businesses, German businesses doing business in Nigeria, investing in Nigeria. And so far, they have created, uh, from what we had, more than 17,000 jobs, you know, and this has also had a ripple effect on the local economy in Nigeria. They have also been able to train and build expertise, local expertise on the Nigerian side to ensure that yeah, these people also add to the uh, value chain in the whole uh, investment, uh, foreign direct investment drive. And, you know, looking at um, this particular Compact with Africa Summit, just yesterday, the German Chancellor Olaf Scholz announced a 4 billion euro investment in Africa, across African countries. You know, we do not know what percentage each country will get, but there are uh, there are indications that you know, Nigeria has the biggest economy in Africa and the one with the most engagement with uh, Germany as it stands. And also Germany's second largest trade partner in, in sub-Saharan Africa will get a huge chunk of these 4 billion euros set aside by the German Chancellor Olaf, uh, Olaf Scholz. And we've also seen um, today the memorandum of understanding signed between two German companies and two Nigerian companies to the tune of $500 million, you know, this is huge. And it's also beginning to show uh, the... Uh, absolutely, Femi, this is... Been... Absolutely, this is huge. We thank you very much for bringing us that update from Berlin.